Hello, all of our friends and family. Hi! <laughs> this is the Burgers Go Tiny Live Tour Hi! that you've been waiting on. What? <laughs> so exciting! So, we're gonna just show you where we live now. And, guys, watch this. I'm gonna run and jump, and I'm just gonna say, I wanna move! Okay, move. Okay. Guys, can you move? So, that's please? the opposite okay. of what we talked about. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so this right here is the farm where we live. Briggs is running by the corn oh, little corn patch. I'm pretty sure you can turn the camera Watch it, Oh yeah, I guess I <laughs> we've never done this. There goes the camera. There's Briggs. Live action amateurs over here. <laughs> He's super excited. There's the pond. All right, Briggs, stay up here, buddy. And there's the bike path, which Spence found out today goes what? Uh, well, this section of it's like 15 miles, but you can bike from here to. Uh, the next town over, you can bike to Columbus, you can bike to Cincinnati, you can bike all the way to Dayton, uh, and some other town that nobody's ever really heard of, and they're working on a trail all the way to Cleveland. Which no one wants to go there. Anybody that is from Ohio knows that. So this is back here. This is the um, backyard. So it's like a grove of trees. There is... Hey, guys. Hey, not necessary on the video. We um, are still... We are still a real family, so we still have kids that go crazy sometimes, um, which is part of why we're here. So we have, um, there's like 40 acres on the property, and there's a big grove of trees, peach trees, um, which is kind of awesome. Uh, and so I'm going to turn this back around and we'll walk up to where the house is. So this is the abandoned house they use for storage on the farm that we're hooked up to. There she blows behind the car. So that is our camper. Um, and we will show you guys. Hey, Andy. Hey, guys. Oh my gosh, there's so many people on here. We're so famous. Hey, guys, we miss you all so much and love you. Okay. Can you like so today we had a lot of firsts. I did my first hand wash dish load since I have not had a dishwasher, which is kind of exciting. Uh, if anyone knows me, that's like a huge accomplishment. Um, we gave our kids their first bath outside, which they were psyched about. Briggs, come show them where you got your first bath outside. That big tote and this little guy right here. Yes, so they got in the tote that you can see right there, which is super classy. And we used our outdoor shower. I took one out here the other night videos of that will be posted later. <laughs> that's going to cost extra. All right. So, um, hey, Lindsay. That's so awesome. Hey, guys. Hey, Christina. This is crazy. I can't believe so many people are here. Um, so there's another first today. Briggs got to collect some things on an adventure with Daddy while I was grocery shopping and throw them in the pond. Hey, guys, hi. And we had our first dinner outside, which we will do a lot because we have really messy kids. And the kids... Uh, Spence is representing right there and <laughs> we the kids got their toys out here so um, we got the bike trailer so he's ready to go on super fun exciting adventures um, there's the grill uh, oh yes <laughs> Laura Jones says no 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 to the PBR Spence or maybe no okay it's Laura she probably doesn't want to see your shower video Okay, so Briggs is demonstrating the cool bike trailer, and he's learning how to bike without training wheels, so he'll get to do that by himself. So, here we go inside. You can hear the tunes we have outside. Pretty fun. I have sweaty face because it's hot out here. Um, so, kids are outside. You guys can ask questions. I'll try to do this, but it's sort of weird. I'm not famous actually in real life, so... Um, hey, Lib. Hey, kiddos. Hey, Jay. We miss you guys so, so, so much. Um, okay, so living room, dining room, kitchen. I shopped today for the first time, which was challenging with a small kitchen. And anyone that knows me knows that I love to have deals. So I had to walk away from a lot at Kroger. Um, but this is the kitchen. So I'm going to try to back up so you can see it. 
So there is the microwave and the stove. Hey Jess, I love you. Hey Becca, hey Megan. Um, here's what Spence made me for Christmas, which I'm stoked to have up. Jessica, you're representing right there. Um, so I'm excited to have that in action. We got our little fruit and vegetable hanging basket because we like to have lots of fruits and veggies, but now there's not really any room. Um, a little toy bed for Spence, really good one, Andy. Hey, Sammy Joe, coffee pot, super important. Um, refrigerator, this is a big adjustment. That's, guys, not very big, but it fits what needs to be in here. Some meats and the stuff that we got at the store today. So that's exciting. We have a double pantry, so there's the top. I'm learning how to stack this stuff. This is not my spiritual gift. Um, I usually like to be organized. And so I keep the rest of it in a slide out drawer down here, which is under one side of the dining room table. So we had breakfast here two mornings. Hey, Ashley, hey, Sherry. Hey, Melissa, I love you. <laughs> Here is the living room. Um, don't be jealous of whoever's grandma originally decorated this. Uh, I can't wait to change it. So now we just have some pillows on there. Um, hey, MK. Uh, we got this little stool, which has our diapers and stuff in it to change her. And Spence's boots underneath. And um, it also is a great ottoman. Here's the TV, which comes out and moves. We have games and DVDs under the TVD. And for those that were so concerned about us downsizing, there's almost nothing up here in these giant shelves. And none of these shelves are being used, cabinets, whatever. Um, one of my favorite parts is, yeah, mom, right? <laughs> this little mudroom closet, because it has our coats and our shoes and Sparrow's diaper bag in my purse, which is just kind of nice to have. Um, homeschool calendar, which we, Spence and I sat down and made today while the kids were napping. Hey, both Elizabeths. Hey, guys. <laughs> um, so this is our bathroom. So there's medicine cabinet, potty, the usual. Um, shower. The shower is actually just the same size as what we had at our house in our master bath. There's our vanity. Um, this is... A little shelf I put up which is super helpful I start work on Monday so I'm gonna have to learn how to um, get ready quite much quieter than before um, so yeah we have stuff in there this is Spence and I's room there are four slides so anybody that knows anything about campers it's 36 feet there's a slide back here there's two slides in the bunkhouse so it slides out each way and then there's a slide in the living room so this is our actual Tempur-Pedic queen mattress which I was so thankful that the guy that parked the trailer for us moved it with Spence because it weighs like 50 billion pounds. So, Briggs left the laundry chute open. So, TV, dresser, um, there's the laundry chute in here. Um, there's more drawers in here. Hey, Andy and Wendy. Hey, Jess. Um, shoes. And there's two air conditioning uh, units, which we're super excited about. Here is a double closet. So for those that were concerned about our clothes, we have a couple of drawers. Hey, Mike. Hey, Melissa. And that's both of our hanging clothes. That's it. Um, <laughs> yeah, Lib, Spence would be tough to fit in that laundry chute, that one in particular. Uh. <laughs> say hi, Sparrow. You want to show him your room? Okay, say come on. It's mine. Hey, Heather. Hey, Jenny. It's room. Okay, Briggs, let's show them your room. Yeah, <laughs> I challenge Andy and Libby to that contest. I will um, love to be privy to that. So here we go. This is the half bath that the kit is for the kids. So it's just got a toilet and medicine cabinet and sink. Mm -hmm. And here is the kids' room. So we added a shelf here, we a shelf there. Um, Sparrow sleeps over here um, with her bed rail, which she already knows how to escape, and she got out by herself. Um, here's extra storage, which this is all homeschool stuff. Um, they have a wardrobe, which one of the things we loved about this was that it had a wardrobe that separates 
both sides of this room. So the room, hey Hillary, hey Kayla. The room is actually bigger than our room because um, it slides out on both sides. And so if you see, there's no drawers or anything on that side. So Briggs is on the other side and hers is right here. So she's got storage at the top, hang up clothes. And then she has three drawers for her clothes down here. And if you look over here, Briggs has the weapon slash Ninja Turtle corner, which is obviously super important. And then he has the same wardrobe and three drawers down there. This is their reading couch, AKA extra bed for whoever's gonna come visit. And there's also two beds out front as well. And here's Briggs showing you how he gets up in his room. Well, his I'm, bed. I'm gonna show you how I get down. Oh, that's so important. Down, 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 down. Be careful, buddy. Some fancy Lula Bros you got on there. Yes. <laughs> yes, Lula Bros, courtesy of Sherry Hubbard. Woo! Um, and then okay. his Ninja Turtle couch, which is super important. Go for it, buddy. No. Hey, Kristen. Oh my gosh, I haven't talked to you in a hundred years. I hope you're good. Um, that is excellent climbing, buddy. Perfect. They checked out the climbing gym in town today, so practicing his sweet moves. Um, so this is supposed to be for a little entertainment system, but the, our kids don't really do a whole lot of TV. And actually, since we've been here, Briggs hasn't even asked to um, hang out. Um, so we got a little fan for them and his stereo and their puzzles. And that's the entrance to their half bath back here. Sparrow's getting into toys. So we it's have some new rules. Like hey, Christy. Adam. Hey, Tots. Hey, Adam. And um, so, yeah, uh, the kids today. What did you guys do today, Briggs? Tell everybody what we did. Thank you, Christina. Thanks, Becca. Briggs, tell everybody what you did today. Uh, go check out a climb on drum. A climbing gym. What else? And um, we went to the playground play. I found a bunch of rocks and um, that said words. Watch how I climb up and down. My okay. Watch this so, like so they want to hear about the cool stuff. About so today we met some new friends at the park, and like our friends in Danville at our church, they do um, they hide rocks around, so making Xenia smile. And so Briggs and some other kids got to hide a bunch of rocks at the park and find them. And then Sparrow and Briggs played. About 400 rounds of hide and seek in the camper, which is really funny. Um, hey, Aaron. And so we have the outside, like, table area and the inside table area for um, Briggs' homeschooling. But um, for those of you who are wondering, we really don't know what we're doing. Um, I start a new job on Monday teaching. So we'll see how that goes. I don't know anyone, and we don't know anyone here, but so far we really love it. Um, if you're considering doing this, do it. Um, even though it's short-lived, I think some of the things that have been funny and challenging are we didn't have electric for two days. Yeah, air conditioning. If you're going to get a camper, learn what 50 amp and 30 amp <laughs> and 20 amp and 15 amp and 110s and 120s, all that mess. Yeah. Or make someone else do it for you. Yeah, that was a disaster. It was super hot. And, um, Scott, oh my gosh, you're so old now. Hey. <laughs> um... And let's see. Ma. Auntie MK just came on. Say hi, bud. Briggs, say hi to Auntie MK. Hi, bud. <laughs> I actually, hi, bro. <laughs> and, uh, check out the girl. Wait. She's from Canada. That's for she Callie Baron Will. She right there. Right off. Look at her. Look at her. Um, also, hey, Mr. Rodriguez. Hola, como estas? You I miss are a you. Bit. You are. Um, let's see. We have spent most of our time outside, which is super awesome and what we wanted to do. Um, water, not all well waters are made the same. Hey, Aunt Libs, the kids said, how you like me now, brah? <laughs> um, and so we have been getting bottled water so far, like jugs, um, but it should work itself out. Um, make sure you measure how far your sewage hookup and your water hookups are. Our measurements, not so hot. Um, right here, this is one of my favorite parts too. This extends so you have more um, counter prep space. Um, so if we go outside, like I said, this is what we're, what we see when we get out here. Um, hey Courtney, hey Tess, hey Lala. Um, 
they're getting ready to put new clay down in the pond and put more water in, so we're super psyched about that. Um, this is this side. Spence is getting ready to hang our party lights. Um, it looks, I told him we still look super redneck, um, but it's because we have like 500 totes and boxes that we still have to take back. <laughs> um, and so I'm trying to think. Oh, uh, there's our little boat for the pond. Um, like Spence was telling you guys, if you, hey Justin, miss you. Um, if you guys didn't hear at the beginning, Spence was saying that we, um, these bike paths, Xenia's like super big into biking, and so the bike paths all connect, and they're like miles and miles and miles. The, we could bike all the way to Columbus, but for those of you who have seen me, you know this body ain't made for speed. Ain't happening. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> um, so it's really exciting. Um, hey, Sparrow! Are you having so much fun Say living hi. in the camper? Yeah, you are! Do you love the camper? Hey, Jackie, I miss you so much! Oh, hi. Say hi, Miss Jackie. Hi. Uh, hi. Spence, what's your favorite part so far? Uh, ah. we're, just, we're just outside, like, all the time. Yeah, that's what we met doing, and we love it, and it's so ah. crazy and awesome. Um, what's ah. your least favorite part? Mm, it was very hot mm. the first couple days. Actually, no, moving. I moved every day for like six straight days. <laughs> Something to somewhere yeah. all the time. I think my least favorite part is we're still figuring out how to level a camper. Um, and so we pretty much lay down at night and it's like I'm on a slalom ski slope. Like if I was laying the opposite direction, all the blood would go to my head and I would be sleeping like a bat. Um, it's kind of hilarious. But that's okay. Oh, hey. Aunt Jess says hey. Say hi, Aunt Jess! Hi! Good blower kiss. Oh, sweet. Meredith <laughs> says, oh, yes. Are you reaching for Mare? Yeah, you are. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, so um, this is insane to me that we have like 30 people watching us. We miss you guys all so much. Um, thank you for checking out this crazy adventure that we're on um we know nothing about what we're doing we researched what we could for a year and we just didn't want to regret not doing it thank you christina that's awesome if you pm me um his information i will absolutely do that because we do not know what we're doing <laughs> um the people that we are borrowing their land we're renting their land on their farm are super nice and they've been incredibly helpful mm -hmm. um and we're just really excited and we love you guys and please keep in touch with us um if you want to send us anything we would love love and our kids would love to hear from you guys hey brian um hey margaret um we have a p.o box here in xenia which is p.o box 151 Hello. say p.o box 151 yeah it's past bedtime <laughs> and that's in xenia which is four five eight Four five three eight five. So PO box one five one four five three eight five. You may want to double check that. Hey Uncle Steven. No, it really is, I swear. And um several of you, I'm super humbled. Papa Joe! Hey, we love you! Say hi to Papa Joe! Hey Papa hey, Joe! Papa Joe. Hope you're feeling good. We've been praying for you. Um, I'm gonna write about this. So we got our computer today finally. And so for those of you who have been following the mama on the rocks.com, I'm going to um be blogging about this it's crazy we're weird um but we're super psyched hey tori heather um taylor harper says hey spence um and so we're excited and we want you guys to check out what we're doing and um be thinking of us and praying for us because this is crazy with two kids um and with briggs's behavior disorders we're just really prayerful that all the research we've done will show that um this will be paid <laughs> off and we'll get it together and and things will be awesome um so we're looking forward to a lot of biking a lot of hiking climbing i may also vlog my day to day <laughs> as becoming a stay-at-home dad in a camper should be a good time <laughs> yeah i feel like uh, grumpy spence is going to be extra grumpy hey pat what's up probably a lot of tears <laughs> so we're excited oh no hey we're gonna um say bye to everybody would can you do that there's you Briggs. To to Can you say bye to Callie, Mary, and Will, and me, Mom, and Papa, and everybody, Miss Jackie? Everybody's on here watching you. What do you think? Bye. Bye. <laughs> hey, Aaron. Oh, you are awesome. Thank you. 
Love you, bye, yep. <laughs> okay, so we love y'all and we're excited here. Let's get the camper in the background. The oh, eagle. No. Anybody that has any awesome um, camper names, we've got to rename this thing. Uh, the eagle's just not doing yeah. it, so. Elliot says bye, Briggles. Can you say bye to E? You hooking some stuff up? Can you bye. say bye, E? <laughs> All right, bye, guys. We're going to shut this off. I think once you guys go, once you're done going live, you can rewatch it. So you can share it. But <laughs> definitely check out themomaontherocks.com. And I'm hoping by next week we'll get um, our first blog going live um, about our, our little adventures. Hey, Quentin. Hey, Sherry. Hey, Nikki. We love you guys so much. And you can go back and watch this after we sign off. So we'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.